What is going on? Good morning. How is everybody doing? What is the exciting news that you guys have for this weekend? Did you guys do anything fun? We went bowling for Elijah's birthday and daddy took everybody bowling and then I bought pizza and daddy got Elijah some gifts and I got him a couple things. I still want to get him like a gift card because at 14, you don't know what these kids want. I don't even know what they want and I already have, I have three teenagers. So it was Elijah's 14th birthday. Did I say that? Um, I hope you guys all had a wonderful weekend. Tell me and share in the comments what you guys did. We also went and watched the Niners whoop the Cowboys. Oh yeah, I'm a Niner fan. Yes, I am. Um, actually, no, I can't even say I'm a Niner fan because to be honest, I just like watching football and my honey is a die-hard Jets fan. I mean, die-hard Jets fan. Um, I, I'm a Niner fan because it's what I grew up with, but I just like watching football, so you can catch me in any kind of jersey. I really don't care because I just love watching football. Um, so we went and watched that last night. As you can tell, I'm not presentable. <laughs> I'm tired. Um, I gotta go to Costco. Um, we got a surprise. Stay tuned for the surprise. Um, it's, it's cute. It's, eh. I don't know how I feel about it yet. Uh, it was daddy's decision, but I mean, whatever, it is what it is. <laughs> so I gotta go to Costco, I gotta do some cleaning up here. I wanted to decorate a little bit for Elijah because he did not get, I did not get to decorate for him. It was kind of like a boom, boom, boom thing. Um, so I kind of wanted to do like a little bouquet, uh, bouquet or what an archway thing out of balloons. And then he didn't get his cake this weekend, so I bought two cakes. I got a little small round chocolate one and a little vanilla one because I didn't know which one he would like. That kid likes everything. Um, so we're going to do that. And then, yeah, we're just going to clean up and we're going to get this day started. But for now, enjoy your coffee. I'm going to get this little baby out of the back seat. I got to clean out the trunk so that way I can fit groceries back there. And we're going to get this day started. So, if you're new, again, I'm Lorelai. I'm a mother, a stay-at-home mother of four. Um, 16, 14 now, 12, and then I have a newly one-year-old. Um, I'm engaged, just got engaged to my love. Yes, look at that, you see that? Oh, isn't she pretty? She's so pretty. Um, and on my channel, we do believe to be real. You're not perfect. I am not perfect. Nobody is perfect. And that's perfectly okay because we like to be real. So if you're new, make sure you subscribe because we're literally on this life journey and it's only going to get better. If you're a returner, make sure you watch the video all the way through. Share the video. You can share whichever videos you want. Like, 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 and comment on my video. I love interacting with people. All right. Let's stop talking and let's get this day going. Come on, guys. and I'm gonna have to do this in sections because this is our monthly grocery haul for four children and two adults and I have all teenagers so I got extra stuff so when they get out of school they have stuff to heat up on their own before dinner time and a snack and baby snacks and I got other stuff so I'm gonna do this in sections I'm not gonna put the price up on the screen for every individual item. I will tally up everything and I will tell you guys exactly how much everything in a total cost. Um, it's a lot of stuff, as you can see behind me, and this is not even half of it. And you can see Isabella is grabbing grapes. The baby is somewhere back there. She is, um, she is eating some grapes. I chopped them up with my little grape cutter. Um, Isabella just got home from basketball. Oh, yep, yeah, look. If you don't have one of these, 
get one of those because they're amazing for little toddlers and grapes. So if you have super big uh, grapes, you're gonna have to cut them like twice though. But Isabella, I just picked them up. She had basketball practice. She made the tea. Um, okay, so I'm gonna show you guys exactly what this is and then I'm gonna go and put the frozen stuff away because it's been sitting out a while. Um, but let me, let me show you. All right, as you can see, this is a lot. It is, it's gonna last us all month. <clears throat> Excuse me. She hears me videoing right now, so she's gonna start yelling. But let me just get into this because I'm gonna have, you know, I don't even know why my ring light's not showing everything pretty bright here because it's kind of dark in the house. Uh, it's super overcast, but I'm gonna show you what I got here. And then, hi. <laughs> she's embarrassed because she's sweaty. She just got home from basketball. Um, so we won't show her again. She don't want to be shown. But, um, no, you little thing. I'm gonna, okay, here. Let me start with this. This, don't mind the floor. This is the new member of the family. You say hi. Say hi. This is Jade, and we will get back to her in a minute. But as you can see, she's getting fruit and stuff, and she's tearing it up off, um, She's just tearing everything up right now. She's a baby and she's teething just like my baby is teething. All right, so I got some pancake, uh, pancakes and sausage on a stick. I absolutely love these. The baby loves these in the morning time. She's able to um, chew on those and, you know, eat those up. So she does like those. I got some regular corn dogs. Um, no, it's not the, these are not the most healthiest, healthiest options, but it's something that's good for, you know, the baby will, she likes them. So we're not, I have four kids, guys. I, I've been through this. I, you know, if, if she's going to eat it, she's going to eat it. I have tried, you know, giving healthy stuff right now. She's going through the phase that she's not wanting healthy stuff. So I got the, um, Pa the six pack of cream cheese because I'm going to freeze the other ones and then I am going to uh, just take one out at a time to see the pizza rolls because the kids like those after school. I got cheddar and jack cheese. I normally do the Mexican blend, but the honey said that he wanted to try this one. So we're going to do this one. I got Ritz crackers for like tuna salad, chicken salads, like for lunchtime and whatnot. We needed more foil. So I got more foil. I've never tried this kind of coffee, but it did say dark roast and supreme bean fine ground. So I decided I like dark coffee. We're going to try that one out. Okay, soft and chewies. Again, no, they're not the healthiest for the kids, guys. But you know what? Honestly, they're good and the kids eat them. So that's all I care about. <laughs> um, I got the butter toffee cashews. I, I would never buy them again. I'm not saying they're absolutely disgusting because they're okay to eat like a couple, but I would just would never buy them again. Um, I did get some Honest Kids juices. Excuse me, I got the hiccups. Um, for the baby for like lunch times and whatnot. Those are, I like those for her. Um, it says zero added sugars, so I'm okay with that. I don't know if I said I got the granola. I tried this granola. They had like a sample. Um at Costco so I did get this and it come with a two pack that's really and it tastes really good I got some more garbage bags we needed garbage bags I got some more parmesan and some hummus I have not had hummus in a long time and this is the roasted pine nut hummus and it just it looked delicious and so I'm gonna try it I love hummus though and it's good for you um I got some of the chicken and cheese taquitos. We make those with a dinner on one night and with some, I make some homemade Mexican rice and some homemade beans. So that goes good and it's super simple. <laughs> you don't know if you can see her. The baby is back there feeding <laughs> Isabella her grains. <laughs> I got some spin drift and the reason I got the spin drift is because I'm not supposed to have soda and I've actually been having soda a lot lately. But I have heard that the spin drift is really good um, and it's not as bad as all the other ones. So I'm going to try that out. I got some strawberries. They weren't looking the best, but 
it is what it is. I've also seen multiple people get these Skippy creamy peanut butter and chocolate fudge things. Um, I thought this would be a decent treat for the kids to have, um, like for movie nights or whatever. Uh, and I kind of wanted to try it myself. Um, so I got, I went ahead and I got one of those. Those looked good. Chicken melts, after school snack. I got another thing of eggs back there. Some more butter. Can never have enough butter. I am so happy with this right here. Let me show you guys. I have been wanting this for so long. And so I finally just got it. I think it was like $12, but they're super big. Um, it says 21.5 full ounces, and they're absolutely adorable. So I'm going to save those for Christmas time. Here, let me hand those to you so you can put those on the sofa. Um, <clears throat> I got a pack of hamburger. I had to go into the store twice because it was just me and the baby, so I had to take one load out and then I had to go back in for the rest of my stuff and the first time they didn't have hamburger out and the second time they put a couple of them out so I snagged one this is I believe it's six pounds six point thirty one pounds is that what it says yeah six point thirty one pounds and it was thirty one dollars so eh, but everything is good in like their priced high right now beef flank steak I like to do that and chop that up and make that I got some beef for stew meat I can do a lot of things in the crock pot with that I got the variety pack of cheeses Har Harvardi che I don't know okay in the comments let me know do you guys call it Harvardi cheese or Harvardy cheese what do you guys call this because I've always known this as Harvar Harvardy cheese and somebody said it's called Harvardy cheese. I don't know. So in the comments below, let me know what you guys call this cheese. All right. I got two packs of chicken thighs because I like chicken thighs. I think they hold a lot of flavor. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, and the baby's crying. Hi. <laughs> I got some of these chicken meatballs, the teriyaki meatballs. The family loves these. They're super, super yummy over some like white rice with vegetables. Guys, they had a sale going on, $7 off each pack of chicken. So I had to stock up. I got one, two, three. I got four packs of chicken, and this is going to be stuck in my freezer. She is, a <laughs> no, take that from her. Oh, yucky. She got the, the dog's blanket. <laughs> Put that in the garage, Izzy. Um... That's my life. She's playing with the dog's blanket. Um, I don't know if you can see her over there. Let's see. She's trying to get outside right now. Excuse me. You're not going outside. <laughs> All right. So I did get a lot of the chicken breasts and I stocked up on that. Um, I think I might go back and get some more too because that's a good deal. Seven bucks off. So I mean, I mean, at least I thought that was a good deal. We got some more of the chicken and apple. We like to make this for like breakfast sausage. Um, all right, so I'm trying to get this dog out of the kitchen because she's biting my light. I got some of the pineapple sausage ones. Um, I, I mean, I like this. The honey doesn't eat this because it does contain pork, so he doesn't eat this. He does like the hot link ones though. So we got those. Ah, uh, la, 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 let's see. Okay, I'm going to come over here before I move downwards and show you guys a couple things that I got down there. I didn't, let me see, hold on. You guys cannot even see. All right, don't mind the dishes on the corner. Um, I got some more garlic, another thing of mayo. I got some sour cream. My oldest likes pesto, so I'm going to make another pesto thing. Um, I've seen these all over. I tried them. I honestly thought it was just like Reese's peanut butter cups. I didn't read that it was like animal cracker dipped. Um, they're okay. They're I, Like I said, I wouldn't buy these either again. Um, but they are okay. I got some extra crispy fast food fries. I don't know how crispy they're going to be though because they're really mushy right now. <laughs> I got some of the baby bells because I figured I can peel them and let the baby have them for a lunch. And then I got a heavy whipping cream. All right, so moving down here. This is my seasoning bucket. Everybody knows this. I did get a Charlie Brown 
do you want you want a baby? You can just say, "Can I have a baby, Bill?" <laughs> Bella's like, can I have a baby bell? Um, I did get a Charlie Brown Christmas book. This is really nice. Um, the baby loves books. So this is kind of like what I'm happy about. This is an advent calendar and it is 24 storybook library um, advent calendar. And... It is little mini books. I don't know if you guys can see this. Let me see. Can you guys see that? It is, look at my hand. I got stuff all over my hand. Um, it's, they're all Christmas though. They're all Christmas themed and it's like a countdown to Christmas time. So I thought the baby would really like that. She loves, loves, loves reading. So I got that. Our little new addition, needed food. I got her some food. I got the kitty cat some food. Another bag of flour because I do lots of baking around this time and towards the end of the year. I got some of the little tiny potatoes and I got some golden potatoes. And I am going to put everything away. I'm gonna get all this stuff put away. Everything, everything. And then we will be back to show you guys what else we got. Cause like I said, guys, this is not all. <laughs> we'll be back. Okay, so I could not resist. I wanted to try the hummus as I'm putting these groceries away. So I tried it. Mm -mm -mm. Absolutely delicious. Now this, I would buy again. Oh, seems like somebody else likes it. So is it good? Mm -mm. No, mm -mm. as you're scooping it, <laughs> she's like, Mom, you have to mix it. I'm like, No, you don't mix it, you just scoop it. She's like, No, Mom, you gotta mix it. I'm like, You do not mix it. <clears throat> so good. Get some of the pine nuts on top. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. So good. This is so yummy. So, 10 out of 10. Do recommend. Uh -huh. All right, as I was putting the stuff away, I realized I might as well just go ahead and separate the hamburger meat right now. So, that is what I'm gonna do. I washed my hands. And I'm all out of the half gallon size bags. So I'm just gonna use the sandwich bags and I'll probably pull out two whenever I need them because that's what you do, you improvise with what you got. So I'm just gonna fill up each bag. See how much I can get into each bag. I'll probably need a couple more of these bags too. But, <clears throat> Do you guys like to buy your guys' meat already separated because it's easier or do you like to just kind of separate it yourself? To me, I like separating it myself because I feel like you get more if you do that. And then I can adjust of how much I need to take out. So I kind of like doing it myself, I guess, if that makes sense. But...
for the second round? I'm not even ready for the second round. Oh, that took me like over an hour, almost two hours just to put that other stuff away and to separate meats and to put things in the freezer and rotate stuff because I like to rotate my older stuff to the front and then put my, my new stuff in the back. It's a whole process. But now we're gonna move on to the veggies and what else? We're gonna move on. Yeah. All right, y'all. Right, As you know, Miss Rachel's playing in the background. We're gonna come over here and we are gonna show you what I got. So, I don't know if I showed y'all the potatoes. I got those potatoes, I got the baby potatoes, and I got some sweet potatoes. Then I got a big bag of onions. And the onions were like completely ripped open, so I'm not really sure how many are supposed to go in the bag, so I just tossed a whole bunch in the bag. I may have gotten a little bit lucky, but hey, yeah. So, um, I got a bag of limons, some green beans, some romaine heart lettuce, um, so that way I can eat more healthier, which is probably not gonna work, but <laughs> um, I got some bell peppers. I think this is the cheapest price I've, I've seen in stores and everything else. I got a big bag of cuties, and for some reason, this bag, it just says it's a five pound bag, but it seems a lot bigger than I, um, than I used to get. It seems like there's a lot more in here. So we're gonna let the baby try these and see how she does on these. I don't know if you guys have ever tried these, but these are like my absolute favorite cookies. I used to go to this little Italian uh, bakery where I used to live when my kids were really, really little. We would walk down the street to this little Italian bakery and we would get some of these cookies and I would bring them home and the kids would eat them with hot chocolate and I would eat them with my coffee. Oh, so good. All right. I got some of the pumpkin streusel muffins. Streusel, streusel, you know what I mean, I don't know. Uh, poppy seed, I told my kids it's better for them just to cut them in half. So I'm like, okay guys, just cut them in half and you guys, like during the weekends and whatever and we'll eat them that way. I just, I don't know, I thought it was easier and because they don't normally finish the entire thing. So it's just, it's better. Oh my God, look at my nails, guys. I peeled my nails off because I got to get them redone before, you're welcome. <laughs> Elijah's telling me thank you for his birthday gifts. Um, so, and thank you everybody who said happy birthday, everybody. Elijah said thank you. Um, so, they don't really eat them all the way. So, yeah, it's just easier to cut them in half. And then if they're still hungry, they can have the other half. I needed more pancake mix. I found, this is new. Tasty Bite has the, mod, what is it, Madre's Lentils or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called, but they have the chickpea tikka masala. That looked really, really good, so we're gonna try that. I got a bag of walnuts, a bag of pecans. Okay, guys, another question. Do you call these pecans or pecans? Where I come from, we call them pecans. So, I don't know. To me, it sounds weird when someone says pecans. I don't know. I, <laughs> pecans just rolls off my tongue. All right. I did get a twin pack of the Hawaiian rolls. I like to make these either with little sandwiches for lunchtime or I like to put them in the oven and make different stuff out of them. I did get some of the croissants, some grapes, Got the double pack of the bagels. I got the, this is the kind of bread that we like. It is super, super soft. Whatever we don't eat right now, I think we're gonna freeze. Um, but this is the kind of bread that we like. Got this for making quesadillas or some tacos or something like that. I needed another pack of the regular tortillas. Bottoms up. Um, <laughs> let me show you guys what we got right here. All right, I got some of the Prego low sodium. And the reason I got the low sodium was because I add enough salt. Don't mind my papers. I'm going through those guys. It's real life. Um, I got the low sodium because I add my own seasonings anyways. And I'm sure those carry a lot of salt also. So why get more salt? Yeah, okay. 
pink Himalayan salt. I do love this salt. Very, it, the light is kind of dim. I'm sorry, guys. Let me see if I can like adjust myself. I don't know if this is gonna work, but bear with me. Um, and it's kinda. This is our favorite. If you've watched my channel long enough, you know that I use this religiously. I love this stuff. It is delicious. I got this. A lot of people use this as salsa, but if you cut up meat and you fry your meat and all the whole nine yards, use this as a sauce. Dump it inside of the saucepan, and I'll show you guys a recipe that I do. Dump it inside of the saucepan, and it is absolutely delicious. God, my nails look horrible. Um, all right, and then this was absolutely outrageous, and I know the amount of sugar that's in it, but we still like it, so I'm gonna still get it. $15, $14.99 I believe it was for this. Outrageous, but I know my kids like it, so I just went ahead and I got it. And that is the second part to the haul. You guys wanna see, okay. I'm gonna show you guys something. I still have not changed out my menu since July 10th. Daddy's birthday is July 10th, guys. July 10th. I guess I can reuse this though, huh? I mean, why not? I think I will. I think I'll reuse that. And then <laughs> today's Monday, so I'll just put what I'm gonna have for Monday on there. And then, listen, don't judge me. I got a lot going on right now. I have a baby who's teething. I have a new puppy who's also teething on all of my stuff. So yeah, we're gonna do that. I am going, as I'm tripping over stuff, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna close out this video because I still got more groceries to put away. I have to clean up. I think I got like 10 minutes before my honey gets home. I need to make dinner. My nose ring is gonna come out. This is my grocery haul for Costco. Dun, da, da, da. That was that was supposed to be a thumbnail. All right, all right. Well, thank you guys for shopping with me. Remember, on my channel, you're not perfect. I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect, and that is perfectly okay. Thank you guys for coming shopping with me, or at least viewing what I got. Subscribe. Did you see that jiggle? That just means I need to work out more. <clears throat> Get my workout in. Oh yeah. All right, uh, okay, bye. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Eli. Happy birthday to you. I didn't know what kind of cake you would like, so I got two. <laughs> You have to make a wish. You get to make two wishes because you have two cakes. It's not how it works. Yeah, no, don't yeah. Skip yeah. Over the cake. No, because we're going to eat this. Okay. Mm, that's one. Ready? Okay, go. What the heck? <laughs>